Welcome back. Let's get things started out there this morning. And we're looking pretty good across the area. Just some clouds currently moving through. Not much traffic over on parts of Monaco just yet. We've had some traffic over in Rhinelander already. But otherwise, the flag booming out there is we have a little bit of a breeze out there. We'll keep that going today with gusty winds up to 20 miles per hour. So I'm sure our camera will shake a little bit more as the winds pick up too. But for now, just a nice view of Old Glory waving out there this morning on this Monday. But otherwise, though, moving forward, the smoke is staying away from us. We may get a little bit in here as we head towards Tuesday night, but it'll stay in the atmosphere. Nothing at the surface will be okay there. But even then, it's not very meaningful, so the worst of the smoke is out of here for the foreseeable future, which is great news. Air quality confirming the good news, though. We're in the green right now across our viewing area. Maybe yellow further down to the south. You have to go all the way down into southern Wisconsin or northern Illinois, even getting close to central Illinois in a few spots with some more of that unhealthy air, though, courtesy of that wildfire smoke. But, of course, that will start to clear out of here from the, most of the Midwest later on. But otherwise, though, we're okay in our neck of the woods. Just a few showers developing in Lake Superior and in the UP as well. But for us, slight chance for a few showers during the afternoon period today under a part of cloudy sky. The cause of it, though, low pressure right about in here with counterclockwise rotation. So a shower or two cannot be ruled out before we're all finished up there. Your drought monitor, though, we could definitely use more rain. We're in moderate drought in our backyard and pretty much across the entire Badger State and Midwest for that matter, too. Extreme drought and so Southern Wisconsin, severe drought in other spots, and we just we just don't have any widespread rain on the way for the foreseeable future. But future cast moving forward, though, part of the cloudy sky, a slight chance for a shower or two that starts to back off later on tonight. And then by tomorrow, though, starting off with a part of the cloudy sky again, slight chance for a few afternoon showers as we get the daytime heating going. Notice that all starts to taper off as we head towards Tuesday night and the parts of Wednesday with these clouds that are kind of moving in. But again, no big deal there. So moving forward, though, dew points may rise a bit as we head towards the Wednesday into the lower 60s, so no big deal there. And then we back off again Thursday to Friday. Maybe a small rise again as we head towards your Saturday, so we may need to keep an eye on that. But again, dew points, though, remaining rather comfortable for the next several days. Temperatures right now, some areas like Medford, Tomahawk, Phillips, and Anago starting off in the upper 40s this morning. Other spots, though, in the lower to middle 50s, a very refreshing morning to have the windows open. Our average high temperature is 80 degrees. You can keep those windows open today with upper 60s on the way. That's well below normal right? The middle to upper 70s return Tuesday and also into your Wednesday. Lower 70s Thursday. Upper 70s are also back again Friday, Saturday, and also into your Sunday. A few of you could also touch the lower 80s during that time frame. That UV index forecast for today, despite the clouds, will be at a 4. That's moderate burn time of 45 minutes, so has sunglasses, sunscreen, shade. Still necessary, though, to avoid a bad sunburn, even despite the clouds. So part of cloudy today, slight chance for a few showers. We have highs in the upper 60s and at west wind getting up around 20 miles per hour. By tonight, though, party cloudy with low temperatures in the upper 40s and at west breeze at about 5 miles per hour. Northwoods furniture and mattress, seven-day forecast, slight chance for showers again Tuesday with highs in the mid-70s. Chances for showers and thunderstorms Wednesday, Wednesday night, and Thursday before we dry out Friday and beyond. Temperatures overall not too bad for this time of the year.